Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Roman RBC, once again the True Football Fan, with another video for you guys today. And I am here to talk about my predictions for the Stanley Cup Finals. Now, as you may know, if you watch past videos, big Blackhawks fan ever since I was a kid, grew up just outside of Chicago. Love the Blackhawks, super great team, always been pretty good. Jonathan Taves, Patrick Kane, Patrick Sharp. Marion Hossa, Nicholas Hildromerson, Corey Crawford, Sam Smith, Brandon Smith, whoever. Bunch of great players on that team. Um, and they just played their Game 7 against the LA Kings in the Western Conference Finals to get a bid to go to the Stanley Cup Finals to go play the New York Rangers for the Stanley Cup. Game 7 goes down. Blackhawks losing overtime on a lucky goal. Bounced off a Blackhawks player into the net. And it was just disappointing into the goal. Uh, big black. I was with a bunch of friends. That's why I was all dressed up. Not really dressed up. My hair done and stuff like that. Went to go hang out and they lost. So it sucks. It absolutely sucks. Um, so here are my predictions for uh, just a quick little video. I'm on a streak of making videos tonight. And I am predicting that between the Los Angeles Kings... And the New York Rangers will go to six games. And the winner of the Stanley Cup Finals this year will be the New York Rangers in six games. Now, I'm not an NHL expert. I couldn't tell you what player needs to show up. I'm not an expert. I'm not an expert on the, the Rangers at all. Um, these are just my predictions. It's going to be going around a lot. Uh, the Kings, I, the Kings are a big team. The, the literally, if you look at the LA Kings, they're just like the Chicago Blackhawks. They're almost the same team, just without as big names players, Oduya and Kane and Taves and all. And Crawford, Jonathan Quick is an awesome goalie. The Kings are a big team. They're fast. They're one of the fastest teams in the NHL, no doubt. I still think Minnesota, Anaheim, and San Jose are the fastest teams in the NHL. Fast squad. Rangers, very fast as well. But the Kings are big and fast, and they can move down the ice, and they can tire you out. And that's how they beat the Blackhawks tonight. The Blackhawks had a 5-on-3. This is more on them. The Blackhawks had a 5-on-3, and they had a missed opportunity because the three players that were on ice, although they weren't the best penalty killers, they were stopping them on the 5-on-3. Jonathan Quick is a great goalie. So your defensemen and your left and right wings, I couldn't... Like, Drew Doughty is the one that needs to show up. He did nothing in Game 7 for the Kings besides penalty. I mean, he did nothing, Drew Doughty, at all. And he had a pretty decent Game 6. Um, so Drew Doughty for the uh, LA Kings needs to show up. If, if he doesn't show up for a lot of those games, it's going to be Rangers in four. Um... The player that, that's on fire for the Kings right now, I forgot his name. He just had, like, the most goals in playoffs postseason. I think it was, like, 14. I don't remember his name. I think it's, like, Justin something. But he's really good. He's a great player. He needs to show up as well. The whole team needs to show up, and they need to be on their game. The Kings won the Stanley Cup two years ago against the... I'm completely forgetting here. Let me go ahead and search this. I'm sorry I'm unprepared, but... I did not think I'd be searching for who the King beat two years ago. Go ahead and go little Stanley Cup Champions. List of Stanley Cup Champions. Here we go. Here we go. Um, not going back to 1893. Um, moving on to the 2000s. In 2000 and 12, the Los Angeles Kings beat the New Jersey Devils. Four games to two. Um, the Blackhawks went the next year and beat the Bruins. And then now it's the Kings versus Rangers uh, this year, obviously. So, Kings a big squad. Kings are a big squad, and they're on the West Coast. Rangers are on the East Coast. The Kings have the home ice advantage. Um, so, if it goes to games, seven games, the Kings are at home. And the Kings are red hot on uh, seven going to seven games. They went to three straight Game 7s to get to the Stanley Cup Finals. Um, I couldn't name off the teams, but they beat the four. 
they beat before, uh, but they beat the Blackhawks in seven away. They, I believe they beat the Ducks away game seven, and then they beat the San Jose Sharks away in seven games. Very good team. Very, very, very talented team. Uh, they can definitely win it all, but I think it's going to be the Rangers. Um, they're, they're just tired. They're absolutely tired. They've played 21 hockey games. 21 playoff hockey games, so the teams go even harder. They're tired. They're, they're going to be too tired for the Rangers. They're going to put up a fight four games or two. There's no way. They're just way too tired. Uh, moving on to the Rangers, Henrik Lud Ludquist, Ludquist, the goalie for the Rangers, beast. Straight beast. Uh, St. Louis, great player on the, on the Rangers. He's awesome. He's very quick. Uh, he's very good with the puck. He's very smooth. It's like he's skating on ice, uh, as my friend would say. Um, I think the Rangers can do it. Uh, they've had time to rest. And wrestling in hockey is a lot, a lot more different than other sports, like football. If you have a lot of time to rest in football, you usually end up faring not very well. Um, baseball, same thing. Basketball, definitely the same thing. If you rest too much in basketball, you almost... You can choke, you can lose, uh, but hockey's a little bit different. They're gonna go hard. The Kings are tired. The Rangers are gonna give a hundred and twenty percent. They're all rested up, and the Rangers can do it. As much as I hate most New York teams, Rangers are gonna pull it out. I'm obviously not gonna root for the team. Excuse me, take a drink here. I'm obviously not gonna root for the team that kicked my Chicago Blackhawks out of the playoffs. So the Rangers, they'll, they'll pull out in six games. Good coaching over there. Good shifts. Good everything. They're, they're a good squad. Of penalties and penalty killing and power play. And everything. They're a great team. And the Rangers will win at home in six games. Four games to two. Who will be the MVP? You, you can never tell. Uh, you can never tell beforehand. It's, it's a series-long game. It's not like the NFL um, where you have one game and like by the third quarter you could probably tell who the MVP is going to be um, most of the time, uh, usually a quarterback. So who will be the MVP? Don't know. Who will win the Stanley Cup Finals? New York Rangers. Definitely the New York Rangers. That's my opinion. Uh, I don't know. Actually, you know what? The Kings. I mean, I could be changing my mind right now. I'm repping Kings colors, sadly. Uh Kings are a really good team. I thought the Blackhawks would have matched. The, the Rangers won and the Blackhawks. Um, most definitely the the Blackhawks were down 3-1. And they had to storm back to tie up 3-3 and then try win game, se game 7, which they didn't. So they were super tired. Uh, I, wouldn't have, I wouldn't have minded it. I wouldn't have minded going to uh, the Stanley Cup final again back-to-back -back years. Three times out of the last five years. But uh, it just wasn't in the cards. So, the New York Rangers kind of pull it out. Leave it in the comments below who you think will win the Stanley Cup final. Uh, New York Rangers in the East or the Los Angeles Kings in the West. In how many games and who will be the MVP? Um, I couldn't give you an MVP. Too difficult for me. Probably be the goalie. Probably Henrik Lud Ludquist. I mean, he's, he's a very, very good goalie. Um, so, go ahead and leave down in the comments below what you think, go ahead and like the video if you liked the video. If you completely hated this video, go ahead and hit the dislike button. It's your opinion, not mine. And if you guys want to keep updated on everything, movie, video game, comic book, anything, ranking, ranking Lord of the Rings, ranking Star Wars, ranking Batman, ranking, ranking Marvel, ranking everything, I'm probably going to be starting a segment called Let's Rank, colon, blah, blah, blah. Probably... My first video is probably going to be Let's Rank the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, and I'll rank the nine Marvel films that have come out. And I'll give my review, little little review, my score of it. And I'll share that with you guys and uh, stuff like that. It's going to be awesome. Super pumped about it. Um, and did I say share the video? If I did not say share the video, go ahead and share the video with your friends and family to get the word around on my predictions for the Stanley Cup Final. If you're a Rangers fan, you should go ahead and share this video because the Rangers are going to win it all. They're going to win it all. Red, white, and blue for the win. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Have 
Excellent. Excellent.